Hello, Seagull. Yeah, I can hear you. It's been a long time. I know. We should put that right then, don't you think? I'm sure I'll have as much fun playing it as you have building it. Giddy up, horsey! Whoa! There is something you should know before you can start. I have offered you a special gift in this new adventure. You mean those new rockets? I hope you know that many players won't like it if I can fly. I know, and actually you won't be able to fly. You'll have a lot of new moves thanks to those rockets on your shoulders. Like being able to roll during side jumps. Being able to grab when jumping to the side. Or jumping backwards. Curving on slots. Jumping and grabbing on climbable walls, and many more. Those new moves are already available for you, but you will need them to solve the puzzle from the beginning. I'll explain all the new moves later when they will be necessary. As the levels are a bit hard, and as you have new ways of interacting with the environment, you'll have some in game videos with tips and helps. If you are stuck, press the up switch. Okay, but you know, nothing is that hard for me, so let's stop wasting our time. I want to play. I wouldn't ask for anything else. What do you know about Einstein's relativity, Lara? Put your hand on a hot stove for one minute and it seems like one hour. Sit with a pretty girl for one hour and it seems like one minute. That's relativity. I have built this engine to enter into hyperspace. Knowing some of Einstein's relativity will help you. Let's imagine we were from the life the size of bacteria and live it in a two-dimensional world, like the surface of a sheet of paper. If a sphere will cross our flat space, we will see only a circle going from a point to its maximum, then again to a point, and finally it will disappear. 
but the real phenomenon will be this 3D sphere crossing the plane which is our two-dimensional flat world. Hyperspace works the same way for our real two-dimensional world. It has four space dimensions, so one more than the world where we normally live, and one time dimension. This means that the 4D hyperspace could look like a 3D world, but the additional space dimension describes in a better way all the phenomena we see. With this engine, you'll reach hyperspace, and I'll guide you from there. But what is it going on? Something unknown has bridged to the space-time continuum. The bridge is getting bigger each second, and this is physically impossible. It is as if time and space are being distorted into convulsing twisted spiral that gets so strange that it creates continuum lacerations. It is something that doesn't normally happen. It seems malicious. If we let it go on, the old universe will be destroyed. We have to discover what is caused in this dimensional spiral before it's too late. Let's start then. I am ready. But I am not. I am hungry. Hungry? Mm. Will this affect your performances, Seeker? Well, not completely. I am in. It's wonderful. It feels like... It's only a passage. You'll reach a safe position soon. <laughs>